Have you ever had a dookie in your butt And wanted to shit it out But you can't cause you're constipated And you need to eat some prunes Drink some prune juice So you can take the shit out your butt Drink some prune juice <laughs> <clears throat> Nothing they enjoy more than a private playground where no prying eyes can interfere with their fun. And before you ask, no, I don't have one. Even I have a modicum of decency. Deep, deep down. What does decency have to do with having your own private realm, though? It's possible to have your own private realm and not be an asshole, right? We won't let that happen. You can say that again. You can say that again? She made a deal with him, with a drama leak, and now she'll be trapped here forever. Okay, you know, you need to communicate to the voice actors to pronounce the words the same way. Because no one else pronounces it and drama leak. They say a drama lick. This won't do. I made a bridge. Summon bridge. Level nine spell. The candles glow with the light of the spirits. They re he doesn't want to be sent into the darkness. Well, does anybody? I mean, for fuck's sake, if you get to the point in your life where you're comfortable with dying, then that's just as fucked up as not wanting to die, because then it's like, I don't want to live anymore. I mean, we're going to kill him anyway. I have no choice. If I want to survive him, I, I have to be like him. You're getting the hang of this. Very good. I don't understand how... Mercy killing these things is making you like a demon. He's enslaved their souls and he's like eating them. They're already dead. Oh, thanks. Thought I was gonna go have to look for a key or something and find the three smaller keys that form the giant key that I need to open this door. Because video games can't just have plot. It's broken. Garbage. Garbage. Vas. It's broken. It's broken. It's broken. It's broken. This won't be of any use. No use at all. It's broken. It's broken. Garbage. Garbage. All those souls. Oh, shit. Souls. We need to free them, snuff them out. If a drama leak can't draw on their power, we'll be able to face him and finish him. I... I... But they're all like me. Every last one of them. How can I... How can I... Mm, morality! Make a choice, woman. Where do you want to go eat? Save myself and snuff the light from God's know how many souls. Or accept that my life is over. No, you're gonna become one of them. This they're soul slaves forever, and the choice is rescue them all or become one yourself. How is this a fucking decision that you need to think about at all? When someone that powerful wants something from you, they just take it. That's what they do. Only an idiot pretends they won't. Yeah, these fucking people are like, oh, the government's gonna put microchips in our skin. You really think the fucking government, you really think these rich motherfucking people who run everything in the world need to put microchips in your bloodstream to make you do what they want? They're rich. They make you do what they want anyway. You work in their corporations and buy all their shit. Running her fingers through her hair, she smiles. Smoke. I guess that makes me an idiot. Yeah. Rain murdering people! I stand no chance of defeating a drama leak. This is the only way forward. 
There she goes again, Andrama Leak. Everyone else just says Andrama Lick. Like when the when the VAs are in the booth, isn't there a person that's like telling them how to say stuff? Okay, she said we need to get away right now, but she's just standing there. Which makes me think she's full of shit. So I'm gonna go back in here because I do what I fucking feel like. Breathe, breathe, breathe. Breathe, breathe. The doctor is in, doctor is in, doctor is in! The doctor is in! He's gonna rip off all your skin! Isn't that gonna open? Isn't he gonna come out and kill us? We just... ...liberated all the souls. Yeah, the, the people who just saved all the souls you enslaved and probably undid hundreds of years of work are right outside your door and you're not even gonna let me come in? I'm right here, asshole. Do something about it. They don't deserve this void-infested hellhole we're handing to them. What is it? Or what was it? Two different things, you know. Okay, bitch. Well, why don't you get over your semantic little grammatical- Oh, you used the wrong form of there. Why don't you tell me in a complete sentence, please? Shut up, bitch. Are we gonna have a conversation or are you gonna fucking nitpick everything that comes out of my mouth? Used to be a school. My husband Griff and I, we taught the local kids what we could. Then the Void Woken came, and, and the Magisters took Griff away to Fort Joy. Said he was luring the monsters in, like my sweet Griff would ever do such a thing. Oh, Griff! I remember that guy! That's the guy who tried to trick me into saving him, and then he betrayed me because he's dumb, and he died. You know him? Is he... was he holding up okay? No, he's fucking dead. Dead. I think that's enough talk for now. Okay. Bobby. Mrs. Griff still lets me come over and play, as long as I don't run off too far. Sometimes... <sighs> A puppet stands motionless before you, just like the ones you saw animated by Toy Seller Sanders. I'm gonna grab it. You can feel a measure of source inside the puppet. Please, leave me. I mean no harm. Not mm. anymore. What? It seems to have gained self-awareness. They gave me too much life. More than the others. Yep, called they it. They did not see that we were in a bad place. They did not but see. I did. So I fled. So I fled from my dream. Oh, I was... I, I bet the guy who makes the puppets is evil. I was hoping that would happen because he's creepy and I wanted to kill him, but I didn't have a good enough reason. But they put in too much. I feel too much. I do not want to kill. Yeah, that's the thing about self-actualization is... You become aware of how fucked up the world you live in is. Hiding. Location. Compromised. Seeking new refuge opportunities. I'm not gonna fuck with you, dude. You can stay here. Oh, he's invisible! I will consume the flesh of the fallen. I will consume their flesh. The light snuffed out. Oh, these people were still alive. I thought they'd already I died. This. I did this. Oh well. I'm just one person. Maybe there was another way. There's always another way, but, uh, human beings are completely powerless, so... Doesn't really matter. Forget it. It doesn't matter now, I guess. Yep. Pray be his. They lead through the silver puffs and into the hall. I have no idea what that means. The priest raises her head and screams to the ceiling. I do that, too. Oh, this is one of the tweakers she was talking about, so... This is just a homeless person who's fucked up. Get away, bitch. She Go home, crazy woman. Yes. Yes. Come, fireflies. He calls us elsewhere. Oh, those were all tweakers. I thought that kid was part of the school, but he was also doing mad drugs. Is that... wait, really? 
They're gone. Yeah, I just told them to leave, woman. What did you try? That's good news. Maybe our hard work wasn't all for nothing, though. I told her to go Isn't take a nap, and she just fucking- like all of them just left. As for him, well, he doesn't even sleep in the same room as his wife. I was asking for information on the Kims. I don't even remember who the Kims are. I think it was that dude who was about to execute that lesbian. And I was gonna steal shit from his house. He has his own bedroom, does Ken, and it's always locked. He's got secrets, you see. Trap doors and ladders. Where they lead, I don't know. But his wife knows nothing about Wait, why do you know so much about this dude's house? You know, he's got trap doors in his bedroom? I thought you were a fucking school teacher. How do you know that? This is weird. This whole... This whole situation is weird. Our master thanks you. Remember, seek out Sanguinia Tell. I, I don't know what that means. It's gotta be back here, right? Oh no, that was where that puppet was. Who is Sanguinia Tell? That is Sanguinia Tell, okay. Who's the who's she the master of? Okay, well I found Sanguinia Tell. She's just trying to get me to take out a short term loan. Like that's a good fucking idea. I bid you good day. I'm not desperate or dumb enough to do that. Dips her head in fair. I wonder what it smells like here. Ugh! Ugh! Ladies, if you didn't know this already, uh, when a man flexes his dick, it's the same muscle that clenches his asshole. I don't know if it's the same way for you guys, but uh, you can't do one without doing the other. It's impossible. I don't know where I'm going. Orange. Oh boy. I bet there's some treasure over here. Or a fight. It's probably going to be a fight. It looks like there was a fight. She'd wait for me in arcs if she ever escaped, and so she did. That's fucking sad. Console Praxir. Please do whatever you can to help. Okay. Okay. We're all buffed up and ready. Step one. Kill. Ugh. Ugh. Infernal ego. Invulnerable. I see. This is what the lizard spoke of. Oh, no, wait, it was a black woman, not a lizard. What can we do? How can we fight an enemy that keeps coming back from the dead? Mmm! I, I guess we gotta get the fuck out, because we can't... We can't fight ghosts. Okay, friends, you're leaving. Ah! So I can't teleport myself if I'm fortified? Why? I might have just fucked up, because if those skeletons come outside, they're gonna start harassing people. Definitely, probably impossible for them to actually kill anyone, seeing as how even these citizens have. 2,500 hit points, but it's gonna be annoying. Oh, wait, can I consume the spirits? I might be able to do that. I don't know if that worked or not. Oh, no, there's another one. Okay. So, no, so that didn't work. Whose soul did I just eat, then? Okay, well, it doesn't look like that uh, solved the problem of the immortal skeletons. So I think I just... I think I just ate two people's souls for no good reason. Go talk to a fucking ghost. 
a fucking ghost. Okay, I'm already bored of this. Every minute that this fight drags on, I'm tempted more and more to just reload and completely avoid this area entirely. Okay. I mean, it's not like, well, you kill them one time, then they're no longer capable of really doing anything to you. So, why then? Why have so many of them and have their turns take so long? Now I got these freaking paladins in the fight, too, and that's an extra 30 seconds every round. I gotta wait for those dipshits to get their shit together. I don't even have my hand on the mouse anymore. This is just... Oi! Really, if you guys could just go back outside and let us handle this, we are professionals. This really is uh, mega boring. The garden is unscathed. Finally, we got someone out of the combat. Okay, we finally got out of that mess. I don't even really want to play this game anymore right now, though, because that took a lot of energy out of me. I see. <laughs> we must enter. There's no time to waste. Well, if it's is something as cliche as destiny, we absolutely have to. I love it when they kill me before I even get a chance to do anything. And I even healed her, so that wouldn't happen. She got hit with one attack and died instantly. Everyone got hit with one attack, because you get forced into a dialogue and you're not allowed to rearrange your fucking people before it ends. So everyone got hit with one fireball. Now he's charmed and he's mad. Great. So now half my party is fucking fighting against me. Well, fuck this. Yeah, load the one right before everyone got fucked up on the first fucking move of the first fucking turn. Just let her die. She was gonna fucking die anyway. She dies instantly. Every fucking combat, she dies instantly. So we got more fucking eternal enemies that are just gonna keep coming back from the dead? Cool game. Cool gameplay. They keep charming all my fucking units. I can't do anything. I mean, for fuck's sake, at least let me spread them out a little bit before it starts. I'm not allowed to move my fucking units. What the hell am I supposed to do? Uh. Wow, Losa, you are fucking worthless. Oh my... Are you fucking serious? Could you be any less useful? I don't think you fucking could! Just shoot the fucking mirror, bitch! Damn! I need aid. Yeah, no shit you need fucking aid. Everyone needs aid in this fucking fight. How is the path interrupted? You have wings! Okay. Living on the edge! Living on the edge! That's the only part of that song that I know the fucking words to. Who does that song, Living on the Edge? It's not Death Leopard, is it? Okay, I just looked it up. It's Aerosmith. Aerosmith does that. Okay, please shoot the mirror now. Thank you. Okay, is that all the mirrors? No, it fucking isn't. They 
They get hasted when all the mirrors are busted up? Wow. This fight's just the best one ever, isn't it? Fuck that. I'm gonna kill these fuckers. I'm gonna kill Losa, too. I left her fucking ass at Fort Joy if I knew this was gonna happen. Am I missing something? Where is the fucking shield throw? Why is Bouncing Shield not equipped? When the fuck did I unequip Bouncing Shield? Who the fuck would ever unequip Bouncing Shield? Time to cash out. From where you're kneeling, this must seem like an 18 karat run of bad luck. Truth is, the game is rigged from the start. Okay. Now I'll just wait a couple years for this fire to go away. Touch the lizard. Whatever you have to say to me, she may hear. Yeah, I'll sick my boyfriend on you. Come and look at the fruit of our union. A dragon, as yet unhatched. And there are more eggs lying upon velvet cushions in my tent. Damn, Dragons she pushed them out quick. Protect them from who? Probably anyone who doesn't want dragons flying around, stupid. The God King. And the God King. The God King? But... but why? Because he doesn't want dragons flying around, dude. There's only one course of action left open to us. I must face the God King and kill him myself. That was something we were gonna do anyway. I mean, he's been a fucking dick the whole game. Your children will help you. Here, take one of the eggs and engulf it with fire. Do so, and your child will be born. Ready even now to fight by your side. Okay, that sounds hilarious. I'm just not quite certain this would be the right course of action. So my only options are, yeah, dude, put your children in danger. And, nah, man, kill your children. Uh, why is there no neutral option? I just want him to let him do his thing. Very well. My child will skip the cradle for combat. I wouldn't have it any other way, really. Fuck it, dude. Uh, I ain't no helicopter, Mom. Must burn. The egg is ready. Douse it in fire and birth a dragon. It's time. Kindle the flames. Hatch Bitch, can you let me look at this fucking equipment, please, before you... Why do... I'm doing something. This equipment all eats ass. It's time. Kindle the flame. Jesus, woman! Hatch my dragon. Open. Oh. A small dragon's head becomes visible. There's a little spiral. The world around it and roars. Well, let's go, bud. You approach the dragon and take it in your arms. I bet it's a summon now. Do your I have to summon? soul has bonded with your child's, my love. Call for it, and it will join you in battle. Yep. It's Off probably a summon. Yep. Based on summoning ability. I... Don't have any summoning ability, so... Just gonna have to leave him behind. Who do we got here? Failed to equip that. Because that was unequipped for some fucking reason. Yes, I know. That's why I want you to unequip. Why can't I clip on him from that? What the fuck? What happened? <laughs> well, that was fun. But alas, all good things come to their end. Yes. Time to get out of here. Time to, time to stop playing this game. Ugh.